okay so if you are using kdn live in windows and you have an amd gpu and your hardware acceleration is not working for you then i'll show you what you need to do open kdn live then you need to go to project then you need to go to render then as you can see here we have a preset for hardware acceleration but it does not work by default this one it does not work in windows it works in linux but in windows it does not work so what do we need to do we need to create a preset uh, to create a preset you need to click here this icon where my mouse pointer is click here and then name it i'm gonna name it amd you can name it anything uh, this is a group name and this is the preset name you can name it anything i'm gonna name it h264 as i'm gonna use this decoder h264 decoder for container we need to choose mp4 because we want the output file to be mp4 so for container we will choose mp4 leave these settings we don't need to change uh, we don't need to change these resolution uh, pixel aspect ratio frame rate scanning we, need, we don't need to choose this we need to change this codec we need to select h264 amf here this one this one h264 amf or uh, if you want to use h264 decoder if you want to use hevc decoder then you need to choose hevc amf so if you don't know what i'm talking about then choose h264 amf and hit ok so now you have a profile uh, for hardware acceleration but this profile use uh, settings like it will control audio call uh, if you, it will control video quality and file size by uh, by its default setting so if you don't care about those settings like if you don't don't care about video quality and uh, a file size then you can just use this if you want to control like how much uh, quality you want and how much file size it should be then you need to uh, add it this to add it to this you need to click here this icon where my mouse pointer is click here and we need to uh, set rate control so if you know how to uh, uh, configure this if you have already done that before somewhere so if you understand these terms average bitrate constant bitrate variable bitrate if you don't understand these terms then you need to choose variable bitrate here and you can control quality here you don't need to uh, change bitrate buffer size you don't need to do anything just con quality you need to change so if you if you want your videos to the best possible quality then select 16 here it will give you the best possible quality and if you don't care about quality you want less file size like if you are if you have less data or if you want uh, file size to be lower for any platform i don't know but if you want your file size to be lower then you can choose 25 here so as you can see we have a range from 16 to 25 so what i choose i choose 20 because it's uh, between 16 and 25 so it's the best that i use for my youtube videos so you can also choose this if you want to use for youtube and for audio you can leave these settings to default but if you want to uh, change them like if you want to see what i use then i use uh, channels to stereo this option then codec i use aac for sample rate i use 48000 for rate control i use constant bitrate in video we choose variable bitrate and for audio it's constant bitrate and we need to choose 192 here so this is a balance between mm, quality and the file size so we need to choose 192 for parameter we need to add one parameter so this is m o v f l a g s is equal to plus fast start so we need to choose this if you want to choose this it will still work but if you select this then your videos will buffer less like they will start immediately like if someone play your video on some social media platform 
then they will start immediately they will not buffer much if you don't use this your video will still play but they will buffer but with the help of this your video will start immediately so that's why i'm using this flag m o v f l a g s is equal fast start i will also put this in the description if you want to copy that from there we are done here we need to click ok so our preset is ready if you later want to change anything if you want to experiment something like if you are not happy with the quality or file size then you can uh, change this you can put 16 here you can put 25 here so this is the range from 16 to 25 that i use if you want to change anything else you can change them here so our preset is ready and your hardware acceleration will work now for amd graphic cards